this is still telling me that I'm going live, but apparently I am live. It happens all the time. You're used to it. I don't care. You don't care. And it's Sunday morning and I'm up for this live stream. So then I'm going to go and work. I'm going to try and make it as short as possible. I'm going to try and make it before anybody hops in, but probably people will hop in. Anyway, it's not important. But what I want to talk about in this live stream is... Uh, I also wrote an email about this, but basically the thing is when you want to learn game development, you want to learn programming in general, all the tutorials and everything that you see online is just focused on teaching, 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 like write this code here, write that code there, do this here, do that there, click this here, blah, 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 yada, yada, yada. You, you already know, you already know what the deal is. So what I want to talk about is how to actually become a more productive game developer, how to be more, how to catch up with all that, how to learn and, the be, you know, like how to optimize yourself to learn the best way. And as I said, I already wrote an email, I already wrote an email about this. And the first thing that I covered in that email is what I do personally, what I think that you should also do, of course, give or take, maybe you will add a few things or remove them or blah, blah, blah. And I cannot cover, cover everything. But the first thing is I limit, I limit my, my time on social media because you get distracted quickly, especially if you sit down on a computer. This, this is where most people, not most, all, every single person in the world, this is where they make a mistake when they start to learn game development or programming or anything else. They sit down on their computer to learn, but then, you know, their phone rings, they check it out, they receive a message, they reply, they receive another message, they reply, let me check a little bit of Instagram and blah, blah, blah. And when you take a look at what you did, you sit down to learn for, I don't know, three hours, but out of those three hours, you were just watching or trying to learn for 20 minutes. That's not productive work and you cannot, you cannot get that productive momentum to start going and doing good things or start benefiting from your learning time that you sit down. So basically you waste more than two hours and you don't do anything because if you get distracted all the time, even those 20 minutes or 30 minutes that you put into your learning will not do you any good. Now, another thing that I also do is don't lose your focus. So I don't lose my focus in terms of in terms of when you sit down and you want to learn a specific thing, focus on that thing at a hand. Don't go and, and you know, look, don't get distracted. Like though if you're on YouTube, you're watching my tutorials or someone else's tutorials, doesn't matter. Don't go and then click on the cat video on the side or click on the whatever video to watch the new Sonic trailer or whatever you're doing because because you, again, when you shift away from the thing that you are currently doing, you're losing your focus. And when you come back, it's hard to retain, to get back into that focus again, because our minds work like that. You know, you, you cannot like just program yourself. Okay, I'm in the focus mode and now everything you do will be completely focused and blah, blah, blah. So the more you, the more you lose focus, the, the, the less you will learn the specific topic that you're trying to learn. Now, another thing that I also do or recommend you to do is rest well. So most people today don't know when they go to sleep, don't know when they wake up. This is one of the biggest issues people have today because if you don't rest well, you will not get shit done. Same for me. You know, like I created, I believe, around 17 or, or, or 18 games in the past 17, 18 days but I would not be able to do that if I don't sleep well, if I don't know when I go to sleep, when I don't know where, when I don't know when I go to sleep and when I don't know when I wake up. So yeah, definitely make sure that you track that. Another thing that you should also do is, well, that I recommend is exercise. Why? And what I don't mean this go and become Mr. Olympia. Just go for a jog, for a walk, because that helps you relax your mind and come back into focus so that you can learn better. Definitely take up half an hour a day. Everybody can do that. I don't believe people who tell me I don't have time and then you take a look at them, they waste like four hours on some stupid things that they do. So take away 20, 30 minutes of your time and, 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 and do yourself that favor. And the fifth thing that I have is also organize yourself, you know, because if you don't know when you, if you don't know what you're doing at a certain period, at a certain time, then, you know, you're like, we say here, you're like a fly without a head. 
You don't know what you're doing. You don't know what you what you should learn. You don't know when should you rest, and so on and so forth. So it's really, really, so it's really, really important that you also organize yourself. Now, of course, these things don't have directly anything to do with game development in terms of you know in terms of tips and tricks but definitely you as a person you need to like improve you need to have a plan you need to have like uh you need to have a plan you need to plan it out how you're going to learn because if your brain is not capable of getting or or, or absorbing the information that you are learning from the tutorial that you're watching you will never learn so yeah these are tips and tricks that you can definitely use what i also do when i learn or work i don't eat because when you eat you your the, all the energy of your of your body is concentrated on on digesting that food so it's taking away the energy from your brain that you can use to think and memorize and stuff like that so i also don't do that so yeah basically basically that is that is what i have for you on this live stream and i am going to hop off because if I start asking or not asking, if I start answering questions, then I will be here for one hour. Anyways, don't forget to get the course special. I have a course offer special. The link will be in the description below. Thank you for your support, guys. And I will see you in another video.